your show? What, what's it all about? World's Deadliest Towns is... Ooh, smashing your microphone. <laughs> uh, World's Deadliest Towns is um, you know, a show that I've wanted to do for a long time. And it basically, uh, I'm hoping the viewer draws away what it's like to live in a town uh, that you're under constant threat of animal attack. Right. So we went to India and studied um, towns where elephants were basically breaking into homes and taking people out of elephants? bed. Elephants? Aren't yeah. elephants like gentle giants? Or... They can be, but they're also giants, right? So when, you, yeah. when they decide to fight, they're one of the toughest animals out there. You know, five tons of anger is, is a lot. With tusks. Yeah, exactly. Right? And, they, and they, they travel in gangs. So when they do decide to fight, they fight hard. You run around a lot, don't you? I'm always around, yeah. So how do you stay fit? You're you're obviously a very fit guy. I have to he spend, is a very fit guy. <laughs> I have to spend a lot of time at the gym. You know, the, the number one thing that I uh, I'm responsible for is my own safety. You know, the network you know depends on me to stay alive, and I feel like uh, the gym's a big part of that. And so even you know times now I'm on a, I'm on a big press tour. My schedule is super tight. I got to find time to work out. And if I have to wake up an hour early instead of getting six hours sleep, I get five hours sleep. That's just the way the way it is. I, my trainer's job is. In any circumstance, I've got different workouts that I do with just camera gear. You know, really? the, the, the stuff like I'll bring the big boxes that they, that they use and my workouts, you know, around that. And there's times I can use rocks and there's times that I can really, you know, hit the gym. You Anything know. around you, right? Yeah. I'll you, start working out with microphones. Oh, uh, perfect. See, there right? you go. Yeah. You gotta, I mean, there's five or six heavy things in here. Exactly. I'll, I'll, the chairs you, or whatever. You could, do, you could do step ups on these chairs all day. Oh, those are the worst. Oh, you do burpees. I mean, you, you, you know what burpees are? Yeah. Yeah, you, do, you could do like 100 burpees. You do 100 burpees every day, you'll be one fit guy. I'll do 10. Then I'll, oh, I'm there done. you go. <laughs> start with 10 then. <laughs> Right. You were voted People Magazine's se one of the sexiest bachelors in the world. Right. So, um, for someone who watches you on TV, and the chicks will watch you on TV, and they're like, damn, he's hot. That's great. I want to hook up with him. I'm mad. Okay, but what don't they know? Okay, like, because your, your schedule, your your life, oh, what, yeah. what, I mean, what are they getting themselves into? Yeah, unfortunately, most of the girls don't figure that out until they were already dead. Yeah, right? Yeah. And then, then, that's why they don't stick around all that yeah. long. It's like girls having a, a thing for firemen. And then yeah. They say, no, he's always out there fighting fires. That's his job. Yeah, you're away all the time. I mean, yeah. my job, I'm always away. You yeah. know, taking a back seat to, you know, my schedule is pretty tough for most women, I yeah. think. Uh, also, there's a reason why lions like me a lot more than people do. Uh, you know, I'm, I'm a pretty reclusive kind of guy. Right, you're so, always with them, right? Yeah, I, I think you have to get used to living with uh, my, my animal instincts, I think, unfortunately. Um, yeah, who knows? And there's, there's a reason why I'm 36 and single. You know, I'm obviously not that easy to do.